So you're the skier, yeah. you're the snowboarder. Yeah. Ready? One, two, three. Which one's better? Skiing. Snowboarding. <laughs> Carving, shredding, heel edge, toe edge. What is truly the better winter sport? Is it skiing or snowboarding? I took a short drive up the mountain to Silver Star Resort here in Vernon, BC, and I asked you, our viewers, which is better. I like being able to control both of my legs at the same time. If I'm stuck to one board, I'm face planting instantly. I've been skiing since I was 16, and I definitely love the, the way they've modernized and up, um, made skiing you know, easier. Skiing is not a modern concept. In fact, some believe that man used skis during the last ice age, but really took off from military operations in the 18th century. It was the Norwegian army that held skills competitions involving skiing down slopes. Now, snowboarding was developed much later in 1965 in Muskegon, Michigan, where Sherman Poppin, who was an engineer, invented a toy for his daughter by, get this, fastening two skis together. Why not snowboarding? I've never tried snowboarding, but it looks way too hard. <laughs> <laughs> I picked up snowboarding last year, and trust me, it's a steep learning curve. Which one's better? Skiing. Skiing, 100%. On the groomed runs, it's easier to turn. I feel easier to carve, easier to get speed on the skis, just because you don't have to be on the edge at all times on the snowboard. And in the icier snow, the edges are a lot harder to, to grab. Why is snowboarding better? It's just got more skis and style. It's, just, it's definitely more of a challenge to learn. Yeah. I agree with that. And skiing, yeah, I agree. But totally. skiing's harder to get good at. I grew up like skateboarding all the time too, so that's why I like snowboarding. But it just I think I feel right. like I have more control and stuff. I tried skiing once, and I would always fall on my face, so I gave up after that. So, do you think one is more risky than the other? Uh, I would say snowboarding because be you're attached to the board at all times, like you can't eject. So your knees are more vulnerable, your hips are more vulnerable. Whichever sport you prefer, get out and enjoy the gnarly powder that BC has to offer this winter.